Now at six, local theme parks are making changes when it comes to capacity and face coverings. It's all ahead of what's expected to be a busy summer for tourism. News 6's Nadine Giannis has details. Well, major news coming out of two of our major theme parks. First up, Universal Resort confirming today they no longer have capacity limits. That's right, they're operating at 100%. This while Walt Disney World in 24 hours will no longer have mask restrictions for the most part. All things pointing to what the parks normally looked like pre-pandemic. We're, we're very encouraged by what we're seeing. From Walt Disney World CEO Bob Chapek to Comcast CEO over Universal's resort. Very pleased with how um, the theme park in Orlando is doing. Our theme park leaders are expecting a strong summer. Universal Resort confirming they no longer have capacity limits. We really have no capacity constraints there anymore. And so the summer's looking pretty uh, pretty strong. From Sky 6, we got a look at crowds at Universal and Islands of Adventure there today. Theme park expert Len Testa. No COVID related capacity restrictions over the summer. So basically they're at 100% today. Yeah, there is the, as many people as they can normally fit in a park will fit in a park. And then on Tuesday, Number two, buddy, you're under cover, you have to cover. these mask restrictions at Walt Disney World parks are gone too. Um, you know, Disney is following the lead of other theme parks and re uh, relaxing their mask requirements starting tomorrow. Um, so fully vaccinated guests won't need to wear masks uh, outdoors or in restaurants uh, or in line at attractions. Masks are still required on transportation like buses, monorails and skyliners. But for the most part, the theme parks are hoping for a relatively normal summer. Back to pre pandemic numbers where in 2019 it was the best year on record for Orlando's tourism. Visit Orlando's president Cassandra Mate saying we aren't just on the road to recovery. We're already there at the direction and and advice of the healthcare workers, uh, you know, the professionals, it is OK to move forward. And so we're ready and we've done it in a very positive way. So you can come to Orlando, enjoy what we have to offer. And both Universal Resort and Walt Disney World say they are excited for a big summer. Walt Disney World saying that their reservations are up this summer. Their cruise line reservations also expecting a huge boom, considering the fact that they done little marketing this year. In Orlando tonight, I'm Nadine Giannis getting results, News 6.